Welcome back to Cooking with Goldie. And today we're going to be talking about chopping onions and peppers. Now that may seem strange to you, but when I went to visit my mom and I watched my mom chop onions, she's been cooking for years and she's a great cook, but it looked like so much hard work. And last month I was over at a girlfriend's house and we were cooking together and I watched her chop onions and peppers and I thought that's way too much work so I want to share this with you today if you've got a simple way of doing it that's great if not I hope this helps okay with the onion what some people do is they slice it this way and then work at chopping it I found that if you are cutting across and you do want a sharp knife sharp knives are a necessity they do not have to be expensive, except if you don't have really good knives, you're going to go through them more quickly, uh, spend my extra in the long run, but you're cutting both ways. Then, when you're slicing this way, you can you just have nice little chunks there, and it works great with it. See how those are just nice and fall apart? Next, I'm going to show with the pepper. Here, if you take your pepper, you know, clean it out, cut it in half, going to work with that. If you just make strips this way with it, or you're holding it together, and go this way, strips down this way with it. You got the right part there. It is really easy. to just chop it and have it, and it's done. Simple. Hope you find this helpful.